Hey YouTube, Magma Rhino here, and today it's my birthday! Woo! Um, not really that exciting, um, but I turned 17 just in case you care. Um, so yeah, enough of that. Um, so anyway, today I figured for my birthday I'd talk about something that I think a lot of people will look forward to, not as much as Ice Cream Sandwich, but alas, this is the next biggest update for Android, Jelly Bean. And it is official, it's going to be called 4.1. Now the reason for this, the reason they're not going to 5, is because they want to try to unify the entire Android platform. Right now only about 5% of devices run Ice Cream Sandwich, because a lot of developers are slow in um, tweaking the operating system to their own likings, adding their own, um, whatever it's called, skins, like, um, you know, Sense and TouchWiz and stuff like that. And it takes some time. So Android's trying to unify it, Google in specific. They want to get all the devices running 4 point something. Kind of like before they had all the smartphones running 2.2, 2.3, whatever. Um, they want to reunify it, but with all devices running 4 something. Um, now, Jelly Bean, there isn't much known about it. Um, the one thing that has been confirmed, the Galaxy Nexus will be the first to receive it, which isn't very surprising. Um, also, there may be a tablet coming out made by Asus, um, the Galaxy Tab, and that's supposedly going to be released with Jelly Bean um, for 250 bucks, running Tegra 3, some impressive specs at a low price, um, but, you know, none of that was confirmed yet. Um, Features-wise, I don't... Nobody really knows, to be honest. Um, one person... Here, they they believe the search bar is going to be redone. It's going to be a little bit more transparent. Um, really not a huge change at all. But also, it looks like there is a new... Uh, unless that's some kind of app you can download. What I'm guessing is there's going to be new widgets. There's going to be maybe one or two new built-in apps. At the moment, this is pretty much stock. There's a few I installed. Um, but this is, keep in mind, there's Asus here, stuff here, too. But, I mean, stuff like Play Books, Play Movies, Play Store... Um, calculator, calendar, those might be tweaked a little. Uh, there might be more widgets added here. A lot of these, again, are Asus added, but you never really know until they release it, um, and people can start, you know, doing videos on them. So really, the features-wise, nobody knows much yet. Obviously, there's going to be optimizations to the firmware um, in the settings menu. Oh, how do I do this? I forget how to do it. There we go. I haven't used this tablet in a while. I mean, I'm um, on stock firmware because I'm doing the wrong ROM comparison. Um, but anyway, they're probably going to add more settings here and more stuff you can change. Because, um, like, you know, with Ice Cream Sandwich, they reorganized this. They made it a lot easier to follow. They added these little quick toggles, this more this daddy usage stuff, some really great stuff. So expect a lot more good features like that on Jelly Bean. Um... But other than that, not much more about it is known. Um, Google's doing a pretty good job at keeping it concealed, keeping it secret. Um, there was like a few slight leaks, um, a few intentional leaks. Like, the reason we know it's definitely going to be 4.1 is because now if you buy the uh, Galaxy Nexus from the um, hardware section of the Google Play Store, it says the Galaxy Nexus will be the first to upgrade to 4.1 Jelly Beans. So... There you go, they just set it black and white. Um, there's really nothing to try to interpret there. It's just basically, they say it flat out. I don't know if it's... Yeah, here it is. As you can see, Galaxy Nexus, HSP Plus, the latest smartphone from Google. Soon to be first phone with Android 4.1 Jelly Bean. So it's confirmed, that's the name, it's confirmed Galaxy Nexus will get it first. Um, features not confirmed at all. It's not really confirmed what it'll do, but it is um, kind of a second attempt for Google to try to unify the entire platform. Because now what's going to happen is developers who are already upgraded to 4.0, uh, which isn't many, it's mostly companies that released phones with 4.0, they're going to upgrade to 4.1. Older phones will upgrade to 4.0, eventually to 4.1, then they'll be rolling out 4.2, and they want to get everything in the 4s, because that's a lot more unified, they'll have a more unified look. That's pretty much it for the video. If you did watch it this far, you're going to be some of the first people to know I have a surprise coming, but I can't 
tell you exactly what that surprise is. You're just going to have to see for yourself. So if you'd like to find out the surprise, I suggest you subscribe. Um, unless you are already. I promise it's a good subscribe. Oh my god, I'm stupid. <laughs> getting older and getting dumber. Um, I promise it is a good surprise. But I, I don't know why I'm actually not telling you. I just kind of want to keep it a secret and uh, shock all you guys. But I'm, I'm really excited for it. And I really want to show you guys and tell you guys, but I just can't because I don't actually know why I can't. But, you know, you can guess all you want. You won't actually know for another mm, two or three weeks, maybe maybe a month. It's kind of a late birthday present. But, um, yeah, it's pretty cool. And I'll definitely show you guys once I get it. So uh, that's pretty much it. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you all later.